based on the testimony of a former guerrilla and army collaborator, Santiago Cabrera Lopez, uh, Ms. Jennifer Harbury uh, told us she became convinced in early 1993 that her husband had survived interrogation. Concealing information in a murder investigation is extremely serious. Concealing information from the spouses of murder victims years after the crime is, in my view, a very bad decision. The American people's confidence in the CIA's ability... Thank you, Ambassador Watson. We'll turn now to uh, Admiral Studeman. And I sympathize deeply with Ms. Harbury, Mrs. Devine, and all those who have lost loved ones in circumstances such as these. I know that our inability to provide answers to all the questions that torment them caused pain, frustration, and anger. But I also believe that we acted in good faith throughout, doing our best to help them and to share with them as much information as we could. Our dissatisfaction... Correct to say that the interagents... But, I don't, but I, 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 I'm really uncomfortable going I, further beyond that. My time, is, my time is up, Mr. Mr. Secretary, but I didn't ask you if you knew every detail. I asked mm -hmm. you if you knew purpose, I asked you if you knew methodology, and I asked you if you knew cost. That's not every detail. Okay. I didn't ask you if you knew name, rank, and serial number mm -hmm. of every individual that was down in Guatemala. Mm -hmm. I ask you a much more generic and general question. And, uh, Senator Kerry, for pursuing uh, with uh, great respect. Yeah. Let me state emphatically that the CIA is not complicit in the murder of Mr. Devine nor the apparent killing of Mr. Bamaka, nor has the CIA deliberately withheld information. On the contrary, CIA information provided important insights into what transpired in these two cases. Third, there was one instance in January. Indeed, our success depends on the ability to protect the identities and activities of those individuals who agree to work with us on a clandestine basis. In agreeing to do so, they put themselves at great personal risk. If we fail to satisfy this fundamental obligation to our sources, we will find few people who will be willing to support our efforts. That uh, Captain Contreras was convicted and yes, then sir. mysteriously escaped. That while there have been some reports that, that say that Colonel uh, Alpitas may have been uh, at the scene or, or of the crime, uh, may have been more directly involved, the bulk of the evidence suggests that he's guilty of a, co of a cover up, that he, he had to have known that these people were in the area and what they were up to. Uh, and that is the, the, our tentative conclusion at this point.